I am talking about my Disney pin collection, which I started in 2011 after our first Walt Disney World Florida um, family holiday. My very first pin was this one, which is a Mickey Mouse pin. It's got Walt Disney World written on it, it says 2011. And on the back, I'll just show you the pin um, protector. You just take that off and pop it through onto your clothes or onto a, a lanyard. And the little Mickey Mouse cover goes on to obviously protect you from hurting yourself. You can actually buy these, like spare ones of these. I actually have all of my pins displayed on a pin board on my desk and most of these have kind of fallen to the wayside somewhere. They're, they're in the house somewhere, I don't know where. So that is my very, very first pin. It's an Elvis stitch. <laughs> Elvis is one of my, I love Elvis for a start, so um, the, the Elvis music in the Lilo and Stitch film really makes me happy and this is Stitch dressed up as Elvis because Elvis is a upstanding citizen according to Lilo and when they're trying to get um, Stitch to behave and stuff so there he is with the signature quiff and his uh, Elvis's 70s outfit and he's playing a little ukulele or something then that's a really sweet one it's a Polynesian Resort uh, pin. It has a tiki mask on it. It's got Mickey Mouse playing um, the drums. A ceremony room in the background. A pirate hat, Mickey ears. You can buy this Mickey ears to actually wear on your head, this pirate Mickey ears. It's got a little um, hoop there for his earring. Skull and crossbones. I think I bought this in... 2011 I can't remember it's flames it's a Mickey Mouse pumpkin the bottom of his face there just says Halloween which I think is pretty cool I'm gonna try actually do you know what I might try and replicate that for my Halloween pumpkin um, and it's in a fire flamey thingy this one is not from Walt Disney World it's from Disneyland Paris it does say 2016 um, because they were on sale when we went at Christmas time to Disneyland Paris. My husband bought it, he popped off to the shop and he said, oh look what I bought. And I was like, oh, but we're, it's 2015, not 2016, so whether they'd stop selling them, I don't know, but that's the Disneyland Paris one. And another Disneyland Paris one, got Disneyland Park written on it, it's got Mickey Mouse, there's Cinderella, not Cinderella's Castle, it's Sleeping Beauty Castle in Paris, it's got Space Mountain there, I think that looks like, I'm not sure what this is over here, it might be, I think that's probably Big Thunder Mountain or whatever they call it in Paris, Thunder, Big Thunder Mesa, and that looks like a pirate ship, so that might be Pirates of the Caribbean. But it's quite a long pin and I really like it, and it's actually got two spikes on the back, on the back there. Next we have got... A Jack Skellington pin. Man of your screams. Indeed he is. If I'm going to choose a Disney man, it's going to be Jack Skellington. And you've got zero. I think that's zero. It might just be a ghost, actually. Jack Skellington's head is, is compared to some of the others, it's got some weight to it. He's got like two, there are two sort of gems for his eyes and he's putting quite a stern looking smile. Um, I was obsessed with Jack Skellington on our last trip in 2015. Um, they seem to have loads of Jack Skellington and everything. Now this one just says Jack. It's got little things hanging from it. So we've got a bat, a skull, a gargoyle, a ghost and a red spider. Right, so this is from the Villains Unleashed event that we went to at Disney Hollywood Studios in 2014. Um, we had real hard trouble finding this there was only one location in the park that was selling the pins um, my husband queued up for a good hour or so only to get to the front and to find out that they'd all sold out um, which I wasn't very happy about because I really wanted this as a collector pin um, and then we went into one of the shops along Hollywood Boulevard and 
by some sort of magic, Disney magic one might say, she, um, the, the cast member behind the counter said, oh, I've got one here that you can buy. And I was like, I'll touch. And then we sort of said, oh, it's a shame that more of the stores didn't have the pins and other Disney villains unleashed merchandise for sale. But I did manage to get it. And lucky too, because I know these were going for stupid amounts of money um, online. So it's got Hades on it with flames in the background and all the dead souls. Oh, no, they're not dead souls. They're some of the other villains. So... We've got here the Evil Queen. There is um, Hook up there, Cruella de Vil. Um, I think that's... What's his name from um, Mulan? Who is that? Oh, Jafar. And Dr. Facilier from The Princess Frog. Okay, these next two pins are from Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party 2015. They were surprise pins. We didn't know which ones we were going to get, so we just bought um, a bag. I think it was a little box, and it had two pins inside. One is Gaston from Beauty and the Beast, and the other one is Scar from The Lion King, and their uh, pumpkin carvings. Right, another hanging down one. Um, this one is for Animal Kingdom. It's got Safari Mickey on it. It's got some things hanging down. So we've got Dinosaur there for the, the Dinosaur Ride. We've got the Tree of Life. And we have also got there the Yeti from Expedition Everest. I do like these ones with the little hangy things down. They're really sweet, I think. Next, we've got my favourite Disney princess, which is Princess Aurora from Sleeping Beauty in her pink princess dress which the, the the fairies fought so much over to make it either pink or blue pink looks like it won out in the end 2015 we stayed at disney's wilderness lodge and i saw they had a pin for sale in the shop in the mercantile and i bought it of course so this is disney's wilderness lodge on it it's got mickey goofy and i think pluto um, trekking in the forest there or in the wilderness sorry to cut you off so abruptly there I decided to split this video up into two after I'd finished recording so that will be coming very soon keep an eye out for that don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you'd like to see more Disney stuff on my channel I'll see you again very soon bye